All right, so I've previously uh, reviewed Vampire Cookies Magic Candy, and I gotta let you know that video, uh, some of the stuff that you'll see against some of the bosses is absolutely insane. And I love Vampire Cookie. Actually, there are some comps coming out for the arena actually using Vampire Cookie, so I will be reviewing those as well later on. However, now we're moving on to our second cookie, and that is going to be Espresso. I've heard a lot of stories already uh, after my live stream that Espresso is absolutely absolutely broken right now inside of the arena so we're going to be testing him out and seeing how good he is going to be first of all as you guys can see he is only level 30 uh level one skill because i never used him uh i got him so late into the game that i never used him so there we go put him in the hall level 70 right there and then i'll just sacrifice the uh you know the skill powders i yeah that was too much why is it at bruh okay well, let me go do the bounties right now. A few moments later. All right, there we go. We're back. Did some more bounties. Thankfully, it was the magic one uh, this time around. And... Okay. Here's another thing, guys. The hall does not count towards the level, apparently. A lot of new findings that I'm, I'm seeing here. Level 50. Now, I can make my magic candy. All right, magic candy for espresso cookie. Perfect extraction, precise, and even grinding is key for magically delicious coffee. A giant whirlwind inflicts serial area damage to enemies and pulls them even from afar to a center, even if they are resistant to interrupts. The final burst inflicts injury and may interrupt skills. While espresso cookie is using his skill, he will briefly become resistant to interrupting effects. And damage relative to max HP is capped at 300,000. So let's exactly find out what uh, we are going to be getting here. Extra damage on final hit. Single hit damage is going to be 261.8% plus 3.6 fixed damage relative to max HP. Alright, so we are having a little bit of that fixed damage here. And then single hit damage to others that are not cookies is going to be 198.4. And that is, that is going to be that pillar, alright? So they're referring to the pillar. Injury is going to be max HP minus 8%. Max HP at the start of the battle for 20 seconds. And injury cannot reduce max HP by more than 25%. So it's going to be the same thing. If you guys look at Dark Cow. Dark Cow has the very similar uh, description as well, except for the injury is going to be 12.5% max HP reduction for 30 seconds and limit is up to 25%. So it is going to be exactly the same. Um, pretty much if you use this guy and the uh, Dark Cow, then the injury is going to be maxed at the first or the beginning. All right. And then right here at 10, so at, so at plus 10, it's going to stun. You're going to stun enemies as well. Okay, I know this guy's the founder of the Magic Candy, but damn! Alright, jeez, okay, stun on final hit, 1.25 seconds, and then you're gonna actually do 325 extra damage to targets immune to stuns. Quote unquote, talking to someone like Caramel Arrow, someone like Madeline, someone like Kalata Cream if he's using his skill, someone like Darker Cow if he's using his skill. And then uh, we have plus 20 increased damage dealt with the final hit to the target immune by 300. So something I want to know, is it going to be 357 plus this? Or is it going to increase to this? Because it says buy, right? But we'll find out. I don't know. I don't know how it's going to be. But I will probably not going to uh, get up to plus 20. I'm just going to get it up to plus 10 as of right now. So here we go. Let's create the magic candy. There we go, magic candy created. Something that I'm gonna have to farm again. All right, there we go, plus 10. That's what we like. Just get it to whatever I can do. There we go, plus 11. Okay, so I've heard that espresso cookie is pretty much going to be using um, searing raspberry here. So we're gonna actually take it out of clotted cream. All right, we're gonna try this team out. I've heard Dark Cacao is really, really good uh, with Espresso as well, but you know, we're gonna try it out because Fitness Series is actually gonna be targeting Espresso Cookie in this case. So we'll just see how this works out. Uh, toppings, real quick five solid almond, five solid almond, five searing raspberry, three solid almond, two swift chocolate, as well as five of the swift chocolate. All right, and the treasures we are using the feather interchangeable with the 
uh, of course, going to be that uh, monocle and sight as well. All right, here we go. We got Darker Cow, Caramel Arrow comp here. You're going to be able to see that Caramel Arrow actually gets sucked into Espresso Cookie skill. All right, so here we go. Let's see how well we do. All right, so crit up right there. Financier shield. And you can see right there, Caramel Arrow actually gets sucked into it as well, right? So really, really nice addition right there. Done as well right there for 1.25 seconds. One million damage. Okay. Okay. I'm liking this. All right, we switched out fitness here for our dark cow to add to that injury stack and also just do some extra damage with the defense down as well. All right, so let's go and see how well this team does. All right, we got some summoner comps here, guys. Let's go. Uh, what is it going to be like? Mulberry, Espresso, Cotton, Dark Cow. Okay, we just killed Crunchy right there. Mulberry Punch, Cotton, Espresso. And Espresso just went, made that Oyster go flying. Okay. Not bad, not bad. 5.5 million damage here. Gee, that's a lot of damage. Okay. Alright, this is going to be more of a challenge here, right? Uh, we got Walberry, Darker Cow. Darker Cow at 4 stars. We got Clotted. I feel like this is going to be Eclair here. Alright, here we go. Yeah, it is going to be that Eclair, but I feel like we should be able to kill off that Eclair pretty uh, relatively quickly. So... We'll just uh, we'll just hope that's gonna be the case here. They don't have a feather like I do, so if my espresso dies earlier, then he's gonna actually come back, do the injury, do the stacks, all that. Wow, doesn't matter. He came back, dude. This guy's insane. Where were you before? Three point nine million. Just absolutely destroyed everybody. Just all right. We got we got another one here. The the four triple tank uh comp right here. Camera oil, Madeline probably here. Let's see how this works out. Yep, it is going to do that four tank. So right here, the uh, camera arrow and Madeline, when their skills are activated, the immunity is activated. They're gonna actually take le uh more damage. Don't know if I'm gonna survive though, but we'll have to see. Espresso, can you use skill one more time? Yep, Espresso can use skill one more time. Wow! That camera arrow didn't even get to dash. Kinda looks scary in the beginning, but Espresso absolutely shredding it here, guys. That's. This guy is meta. 100% meta. All right, here we go. Espresso, Feather, Financier with the Eclair against this team. Let's go. And let's see how this is going to work out. Oh, we got Frozen. We got Stunned. All right, come on. Come on. Survive. Stay alive. Okay. Our Cotton died first, though. Oh, please. Finish here. Nice. Okay, the shield came through. Our cookies are alive. Okay. There we go. There we go. Espresso, 2.3 million damage. Okay, Finish here definitely helps out in keeping him alive. So that's, that's really good. All right, how well is he going to do against a summoner comp again with Eclair this time? Let's go and see. There we go. Are we going to get overran or will we survive? That is the question. They have a Wallberry on the team as well. Okay, Finisia actually gets, got to use her skill before Espresso. Good stuff. Content. Finisir, Eclair, Espresso, 
Katsen. Okay, they're surviving. They're surviving. The espresso being able to suck all of the enemies into one area prevents them from actually attacking our middle and the backlink cookie. So I feel like this is just, it makes it so much easier for them to survive. Because in the beginning, you know, the summon comp, it just overwhelmed you uh, with the mass number. But because of espresso, what? 11 million damage? Wow! I mean, of course, there's a lot of the summon units and stuff like that, but seeing a cookie deal 11 million damage is... It's crazy. It's crazy. But gotta say, Espresso is absolutely insane in the uh, arena right now. Of course, uh, there are going to be more of a concrete, uh, you know, team uh, coming up soon. It's not going to come out right away, of course, because people still need a test. Uh, people have to find out exactly what's going to be good and what's going to be bad with Espresso. So, you know, time is needed, but I still feel like just being inside of the comp, Espresso adds just too much value to your team. Uh, especially with the magic candy so it is something that i would definitely recommend you guys uh if you guys have the chance build him because he just what, what what's bad about him right now right he's awesome <laughs>